After years of waiting and more than one mistrial, the case against a driver accused of hitting and killing a Colorado State Trooper is coming to a close. The jury has the case now. They're deliberating in Castle Rock, not too far from where Trooper Cody Donahue died in 2016. Nine News reporter Noel Brennan is covering the case. He's outside of the courthouse in Douglas County. Noel, the jury has now had the case in their hands for several hours. Right, Tom. So the jury got the case a little after noon today. I just got out of the courthouse and the jury had a question for the judge and the attorneys. So the attorneys are back in the courtroom. They're going over that question. We don't know what it is uh, quite yet, but we know that this case has been going on now for more than four years, four and a half years, and we've seen two mistrials in the case. And it all stems from what happened on I-25, really not far from this courthouse, about four miles away on I-25. Back on November 25th, 2016, Trooper Cody Donahue was investigating a crash on I-25 just south of Castle Rock. He was on the shoulder when he was hit by a large box truck. Noe Gamez Ruiz was driving that truck and was charged in Donahue's death. His first trial was in September of 2018, but a judge declared a mistrial after finding that the DA's office hadn't disclosed some important evidence to the defense team. A second trial was held in February of 2019, but that abruptly ended too with another mistrial, again because a judge found that the prosecution had withheld evidence from the defense. George Brockler was district attorney at the time, and his office was actually sanctioned after both mistrials. The judge dropped the most serious charge against Gamma's Ruiz, which was criminally negligent homicide. Now, George Brockler, again, is no longer DA at the point, but he is actually presiding. He's on this case right now as a, as a special prosecutor and had closing arguments this morning. In those closing arguments, he argued that Gamma's Ruiz had time to move over, but did not. Gamma's Ruiz's defense attorney, he said that Ruiz Gamez Ruiz did try to move over, but there was simply a car in the other lane that blocked him from doing so. Guys, again, the jury has had this case since about noon today. If there is a verdict this evening, we're going to stay out here and we'll bring that to you uh, as soon as we learn those developments. Yeah, so many people are following this case and have been for those four and a half years now. Thanks, Noel.